Jesus was talking about forgiveness, and Peter got really frustrated. How many times am I supposed to forgive someone? He practically shouted at Jesus. Seven times? Jesus looked at him and he said, in fact, 70 times seven, which was an awful lot. And then Jesus told the story. Once upon a time, there was a rich man and he called his servant in and said, I need you to repay me the money that I've loaned you. Now the money he loaned him was a lot, a huge sum. It would take him years and years and years to pay it off. So the servant threw himself on the foot at the feet of his master and said, please don't make me pay it back. I promise you, I will do everything I can. Just have mercy on me. So the rich man said, all right, you don't have to pay it back. I forgive you. The man was so happy and he walked along and then came along another man. This time the first servant said, you owe me money. Now he owed him money, but it was only three months pay. It wasn't as much. And the second servant said, please, I beg you, forgive me. I'll do whatever I can. Only this time, the first servant said, not good enough. You have to pay me back. You're going to have your family sold into slavery, and I'll make sure I get every penny from you. The second man left upset. It wasn't long until the master of the first servant came by and heard what happened. And he said, how dare you? I forgave you your whole debt when you asked. I heard that you did not forget a small debt from someone else. And then he looked at him and he said, forget what I said earlier. You're going to go to prison and you're going to suffer there until I get every cent you owe me. Jesus told them afterwards, see, that's what it's going to be like in heaven. When you think that you can control other people and get mercy from them, but don't show mercy yourself, then it's a problem. And that is something God is going to watch out for. Heaven is not going to be a place where people get all the benefits they want and they don't show mercy and love and forgiveness to other people.